It's just as far as people in general when it comes down to custodials or janitors and things like that. I think people either think two things. They just don't like their job, you know, you know, they just settled for that job or they really enjoy their job. You know, there's no in between like somebody, why would you want to go push a broom type of thing. First and foremost, I'm a germaphobe. I love to clean. Cleaning is therapeutic for me. I'm one of those people that emotionally clean, you know, when you're upset or, you know, I'll come home, whole house gets redecorated. But I, I enjoy the service that I provide here. So with something that I find second nature, I'm actually providing a good service for. You know, when you come and you, I, like I said, I was a student here. So you value the fact that you come and the floor is clean and you know, you can feel comfortable in your classroom. So to find a job that combined what I love to do with feeling good about doing it. You know, sometimes you have a job you might like to do, but you really don't find enjoyment in it, you know. My grandmother was the, the strongest woman I knew, you know, so she did um, many different jobs, you know, but as far as in the supervising lead position, it was the custodian. She took on many different hats. She was never afraid to try something new. Um, she was fearless in my eyes. Once I became a classified permanent, you know, you got the paperwork and the training and then you got to apply for uniforms and all that. And I would remember her fussing about paperwork and people not applying for their uniforms on time and things like that. And um, before her dementia got really bad, um, I would like consult with her with stuff like, oh, you know, I've been doing this floor at work. And she's like, well, do they still use this and da, da, da. So we would go back and forth with that. And even in her dementia, you know, because they can go back and forth. Some things that I would talk about work would spark her from when she would do it, you know, so it was still something that we shared. I never thought of it, like even applying for this job or coming here, but dealing with my grandmother and things like that, like, oh my God, like it came full circle. So it's like, I, I, in a sense, I lost her as far as that connection, but what I do is like, I'm all, I can always feel her and see her and remember the things that she did and things like that. So it still brings me back to that grandmother, you know, so that was makes it cool. All of us, we love our job. You know, we take pride in what we do. Here at Delta, I do feel that because, you know, students will tell you thank you, staff will tell you thank you, things like that. But for the overall field and just overall people, sometimes, you know, they probably think, oh, they're just doing it to get by. But we actually enjoy what we do. We enjoy finding what cleans things and, you know, what will keep it from getting dirty. You know, we take pride in that and we get excited and interested on ways we can make it clean and disinfecting and stable for other people to enjoy. It sounds kind of nerdy when you think about it, but I've, I'm, I've always been like that. And I was considered as OCD, like, oh, you're just, oh, a germaphobe or, you know, something like that. But I do enjoy it. And I'm here with my staff. I work with people who feel the same way. So that's what makes it great.